With its shaggy coat and mischievous look, the small, lively Cairn Terrier is a representative of the original terrier breed from Scotland. Famous actress Megan Fox owns a Cairn Terrier named Sullivan. History and origin of the Cairn Terrier The dog is an ancestor of the Highland Terrier. Foxes were once a serious threat to lambs in large flocks of sheep in the Scottish Highlands. Around the year 1600, a short-legged terrier was bred, featuring colours adapted to its environment, so it could stealthily hunt foxes, otters and rats. Because of their reddish coat colouring, in some unfortunate cases, hunters would confuse can terriers with foxes and shoot them. In the Scottish Highlands, foxes do not live in underground burrows, but instead in stone hills formed in the Ice Age, the Gaelic name for which are cairns. Therefore, cairns became part of the name of the Cairn Terrier, which was officially recognized as a dog breed in 1909. Through a stringent selection process, only the fittest Cairn Terriers were used for breeding. In time, an extremely robust and courageous hunting dog began to develop. Appearance of the Cairn Terrier According to the FCI, the shoulder height of the short-legged dog should be between 28 to 31 centimeters, while its ideal weight is between 6 to 8 kilos. Cairn Terriers have a life expectancy of between 12 to 15 years, although some have been known to live to 18 years. With its small, upstanding ears, the dog's head is shorter and broader than, for example, that of the large Airedale Terrier. Its firm, dense and water-repellent coat makes it easy for a Cairn Terrier to roam through the bushes and the FCI allows it to be cream, pepper, grey or almost black. While brindle specimens are also allowed, solid white or pure black dogs are not desired. Temperament and training of the Cairn Terrier Because of their eternal cheerfulness, many people immediately take easily to Cairn Terriers. They are extremely self-confident dogs who get along well with children and are suitable as family dogs. Their cuddly look, however, tempts many owners to not pursue a consistent training for them, which would be a mistake. With a history as hunting dogs, despite their small size, they always strive to be pack leaders and dominate their family. Favorite spots on the sofa or at the foot of the bed are then considered their territory and they will defend them by growling at those who come near. Exercise and care of the Cairn Terrier The energetic little dogs love long walks, sports and extensive play sessions. Their ideal activities are dog sports such as agility courses, dog dancing or disc throwing. They also love to learn tricks, go swimming and dig holes in the garden, which is not always to the delight of his owners. In general, however, Cairn Terriers do not make too many demands. They don't need too much space, so they can live well in a city apartment. Their rough, dense coat is easy to groom for. It should be trimmed often, which is usual for Terriers. Bathing should be seldom, however, and when doing so, only use a re-greasing shampoo so that their hair structure is not destroyed. Cairn Terriers retain their vitality and alertness well into their old age. As the little dog has always been popular, overbreeding and common breed diseases are rare. Occasionally, craniomandibular osteopathy, a painful bone disease of the skull, can occur in young dogs.